Hello, so in this video, I'm customizing dirt. Hmm. Well, how am I going to make this work? Wait, what'd you just say? Oh, I have money? I'm rich? Hmm. I'll be customizing an Apple Watch. Hello, and welcome to my video. So in this video, I'm customizing an Apple Watch. So this project was complicated. So right here, you can actually see me taking out Posca pens and wow, this is going pretty fast. Alex, you're getting the project done real fast. It looks great right now. Oh my gosh, Alex, you're awesome. Oh, thanks for the compliments. Oh my gosh, I'm so flattered. Yeah, don't don't get too connected with this this Apple Watch, okay? Uh, because like what what you're seeing right here, basically what happened was I took my Posca pens and it was a failure because um, right now, um, just to give you a little background, my um, friend Grace um, wanted to wanted me to customize an Apple Watch for her, her Apple wristband, and as you can see right here. I used Posca pens and they did not stick to the surface. So I researched over and over and over. I guess it's made out of some silicone based rubber and then, um, but then the Posca pens were supposed to stick to them, but I had to restart because it was just so chipped. Like if you blew on the paint, on the Posca pen paint that was on the, the watch wristband, it just fell right off. So that was a real big struggle. But I got over it fast, and I did a bunch of tests, and that's what the rubbing alcohol, sandpaper, and all that was for. Um, I ended up trying to put nail polish on it, and that didn't work either to coat it. I mean, um, and none of it worked. But I found one solution that sort of worked, and so I went with that. Um, the reason this didn't work, actually, is because if you have seen YouTube videos on YouTube about people customizing Apple Watches, those are still, they're not, they're not fake. They're, I, I figured out that um, this one was an off-brand, so I'm, I'm guessing it was made of some different siliconized rubber or whatever. Um, but the ones inside the video are like the real Apple Watch, nice, a nice quality. Um, but I can't afford that because that's a bunch of money. It's like $49, so uh, like the video. Uh, anyways, no, so this one. Um, I started with sandpaper to re to after I restarted I started with sandpaper and I took some acrylic paints to it um this didn't work completely because the acrylic paints still kind of peeled off like if you scratched it really hard um, but like so like it didn't like permanently stay on there like a permanent marker which I did try I did try sharpies I tried everything I could think of but um, I think I even tried like some kind of oh yeah rubbing alcohol I tried putting rubbing alcohol on the wristband so then it didn't it took off the the coating on it and that didn't work either so I went with acrylic paint sanded it down and I really like how this came out actually like it, it's really it looks cool and I um when I give this I gave this to my uh, friend Grace already and she seemed to like it too you'll see that later her reaction later um but yeah so right now she really likes sunflowers so I right now all I have is uh, some sunflowers drawn on there and I really like how this came out this this the stripes actually accented the um the sunflowers and i thought that if i used like a, a dark brown or something like that on this on the background it would have made your eyes go there instead of the um instead of the sunflowers and so i really like how i how i uh handled that i like how I, the color theory and then i hit it up with some mod podge a really heavy coat of mod podge and that was a, kind of a struggle because i got mod podge in the circles or the little holes in the middle of the watch and it kind of jammed it up but this is me giving it to her and um after it was all finished i wrapped it in some what is that called T tissue paper yeah i wrapped it in some purple tissue paper just for you now decorative oh it looks so good thank you yeah, so uh, that was her reaction. She really liked it, and it looks good on her too. So um, I hope you enjoy. I really liked making this, so leave a like so I can make more in the future. Uh, subscribe, leave a comment if you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.